Pip and Posy, the birthday party. It was Posy's birthday. She was very excited. She was hanging up colourful bunting in her home. But just then, the doorbell rang. Happy birthday, Posy! Said Pip. Pip was so excited to see Posy. He had brought Posy a lovely present. Posy unwrapped her gift. A bus! Said Posy. Thank you so much, Pip. The bus was lots of fun, but soon it was time for party games. First, they played musical statues. Boogie, boogie, boogie. Dance with your feet and freeze. Then, they played. Keep the balloons up in the air. Ah! Don't let the green balloon hit the ground, Posy. Ah! Keep the blue balloon up, Pip. Ah! Then hide and seek. Hmm. I wonder where Pip's gone," said Posy. "He's hiding behind the chair." And last of all. Pin the tail on the dinosaur. All of those party games made Pip and Posy very hungry. It was time for tea time, and they enjoyed their food at the table with their teddies. Cheers! They said to each other as they held up their cups. Soon, Pip had a very special surprise for Posy. It was a beautiful birthday cake. Covered in sparkles and stars and rainbows, and a beautiful pink bow. But as Pip was walking to the table, he stepped on the bus. Whoa! He flew into the air, and so did the cake. Poor Pip, he was very sad. Poor Posy, she was very sad. Poor cake. It was ruined. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'm sorry, Posy," said Pip. "Your cake is ruined." But it wasn't your fault, Pip," <laughs> sniffled Posy. "It was an accident." They decided to tidy up and clean up the floor, and soon everything looked much better. Nen Pip had a great idea. Let's make new cakes, he said, and that's what they did. They put on their aprons, got out all the ingredients, and started baking. They made cakes for everybody and free for Posy. They had their picnic outside with their teddies. Happy birthday, Posy! Hooray!